This dome structure behind me is a part of the Westover pool that's covered by a dome in the winter months. They've been doing this since the 80s. I can remember coming here as young as 12 years old to go swimming in the winter time when you can see it's pretty cold out here right now, but inside it's very warm. We're gonna go inside and talk to Kristen Lamb, who is the aquatics director for Westover Pool. She's gonna tell us about some new renovations that they've done at the pool and how it will improve the pool throughout the winter and the summer. The newly renovated pool will open up to the public this upcoming Monday, December 17th. This weekend, the Harrisonburg High School swim team will be using the pool to host a swim meet. Kristen Lamb has been the aquatics director at Westover Pool for the past eight years. She said the domed pool plays a pivotal role for Harrisonburg High School. Part of the reason that we are able to do the dome and part of the reason we do it is because it allows Harrisonburg High School to have their swim team here. They didn't have to add a high school pool when they built the new high school on Garbage Church. Um, they can use this facility um, and we, you know, they use it free of charge for the school. Lamb said she is looking forward to the upcoming year due to the new renovations. What we're really excited about is the pool itself had not had any work done to it to renovate it in 20 years. Your, the coating on um, on the plaster of an inside of the pool is really only good for about 10 to 15 years, and we'd made ours last 20. So, but we were in need <laughs> of um, some real upgrades. So, plastering, replastering the inside of the pool as well as around the edge, the coping edge. Um, we also put new tiles down along the midlines. Um, we also put in lights, which are in the water now, which is going to be awesome for the summer season because we can do swim meets later in the day, pool parties later in the day. We won't be totally light dependent. Um, we also, um, through some changes throughout the construction process, ended up redoing the whole deck area. Um, right now, the only part that's been done is for the diving pool, but the whole deck will be replaced before we open for summer, So, which is going to be great because it was definitely eight. The concrete on the deck was poured in um, 48, or um, not 48, um, 68. So it was 50 years old. So it was in need as well. Under the dome is Westover Pool Complex's diving pool, which includes a shallow and deep end, a diving board, a climbing wall, and sitting areas. For those wanting to know about winter hours and prices. In the winter, our hours are gonna be total 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. Monday through Friday. 12 to 5 on Saturdays and 1 to 6 on Sundays. Um, some of that is lap swim, open swim, and different swim teams, but all of our hours will be available on our website. So if you live in the city um, and you've got some sort of proof of residency, it's going to be $2 for kids. Um, 2 and under is free, so 3 to 18 is $2 and $3 for adults. Um, if you do not live in the city of Harrisonburg, it's $3 for kids and $5 for adults. If you can't afford those prices, no worries. Westover Pool will not turn away anyone that is struggling financially. We do still have a scholarship program that we operate, and we're actually making some changes to the scholarship program to make it more inclusive for lots of things. Um, and so they just need to come, anyone who lives in the city of Harrisonburg, just needs to come and get a form, um, and then we get it validated, and then we get the passes out to them so that they can use the pool. Once the winter season is over, the renovations will be seen in full in the summer season as well, when it's warm enough for pool goers to enjoy the Olympic pool and splash pad along with the diving pool. So there'll be swimming lessons in the spring and summer. Um, and then once we get ready with the splash pad and the Olympic pool open, it's gonna be really exciting. In Harrisonburg, Theodore Whitelow, Breaking Through News.